What's up, YouTube? Hudson Fan 15. I'm back with another mail day. Uh, variety of things here. Uh, gonna go over it. Uh, just a little preview for those of you who are not subscribed uh, to Josh Johnson 55, Amish Dave. Uh, he is currently in the Philippines, but when he gets back, uh, he we were discussing this via text, and I picked it up for him at a local show. Well, yeah. So. Uh, Pretty stoked about that. I just realized my camera angle is a little off here. There we go. Um, got a few Panini uh, Redemption steals. Uh, Shane Vereen, certified freshman frat fabric. That card was made, so hopefully that'll be here soon. Um, and I didn't redeem this one yet. I'm waiting for a call back from customer service. I even asked Tracy, and he said, I honestly don't know. Uh, for those of you who've had Panini Redemption issues, um, they are—they have not had a customer service manager, uh, the woman that I knew of, uh, for a little while now, and there is a new one starting next week. Uh, so pra Tracy promises wholesale changes uh, with the the customer service department. So if you've had any issues, uh, give them a couple of weeks to get uh, their feet on the ground. And uh, then you can start uh, inundating them with um, various claims. If I find out a name, I will let you guys know. Uh, but I picked this card up out of sheer curiosity. I don't believe this card was ever made, and now it can't be. Uh, 2010 uh, Panini Luxury Suite Hockey, Rookies Group 3, card number 159. Alexander Vazyanov. Alexander Vazyanov was with the Devils, and he was one of the uh, group of hockey players, along with uh, Ziggy Palfi, uh, amongst others, that died in a plane crash in Russia. Uh, so for a hard sign card to exist, uh, I've never seen one. I can't find one. All I've ever found is redemptions. Um, I like I said I won this card. I just I don't like I said they may have them. I just haven't seen them. Uh, he did sign stickers for contenders and Crown Royale. So I don't know if maybe they have extra stickers that they're going to fulfill these by just putting a sticker on them and send them out, or if they're just going to be one of those no signature stamps on the card and they're going to have to send something else with. So. I am going to see what I can do with them about that. Um, maybe get something football instead. Uh, there's a couple of teams of people that I know that collect hockey that I could I could take something just as a you know really 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 early Christmas shopping kind of thing, which is basically what I'm doing with a lot of this stuff and why the the redemptions that I've gotten so far seem to follow a trend of of, of people that I know. I haven't been picking up. You know anything from you know the Jags or the Browns or the Raiders or people that I don't know anybody who's a fan of that particular team. So to be continued on that. Um, one MMA pickup, uh, another one where the cost of the holder almost exceeded the cost of the card uh, from UFC Tops Moment of Truth, Vladimir Matushenko. A little silver sticker action. He's not even facing the camera shot, but that's okay. Um, first pickup from uh, Prime Signatures, card number 58 out of 249. Hard uh, sign on card auto. I just noticed the seller sent it without a penny sleeve. Grr. Uh, Delone Carter. But for $5 and change ship, what do you want? Uh, decent looking product. I think this is one that's going to fall kind of um, between the cracks with uh, when it was released and uh, the other stuff that was going on at the time. Uh, National Treasures and now Playbook being out. Uh, I think this is going to be a car a set kind of like the SP Signatures was for Upper Deck, where I think it's going to fall down to about a about a forty dollar price point or so, and uh, then it'll be a nice car, a nice box to throw in uh, for like a mixed box break to add extra autos uh, for for all us for all the uh, the group breakers out there. Uh, so 
and there's some solid cards coming out of it. All right, uh, a few Hudson pickups, including uh, another one of one here. We got 14 out of 99 uh, hat tag, and yeah, that is a little bit of damage. It was stated on the listing. I got the card for a dollar twenty shipped, so why the hell not? Um, uh, 72 out of 99 triple threads uh, Unity Jersey Auto. And got this on a quick buy it now. A uh, little backstory: uh, I woke up at one in the morning to our cat standing on my stomach. Uh, there's blankets over me, starting to dry heave, and you know that kind of guttural cat sound. So we quickly get something underneath it, clean it up, you know, reassure him. I get up, take my phone with me so I can see where I'm going to the bathroom, and. Uh, I just happened to pop on the eBay app, and lo and behold, this, this thing had just been listed. I got it on a quick buy it now for about 15 bucks less than what other plates have been going for of his lately. This is the 2011 Bowman uh, Magenta plate of Hudson. So yeah, now I have <laughs> one of one. Number 76 is tied to a cat vomit story. Uh, I actually told Micah the stomach that, and he had a... a related witty retort uh, to it, and I said leave it to you to have a cat vomit retort ready. Uh, speaking of which, uh, there he is with a package for me. Uh, I sent a couple things his way, including a copy of a weird Al, Al Yankovic CD that was either lost or destroyed in a move, uh, and he had picked up uh, a couple things for me at my uh, local, at his local card store. Uh, hey Tom, here are the cards plus an extra I threw in. Hopefully, if the Colts need him, he's better than last year's options. Thanks as always, your pal Micah. Um, I have a guess of what he's referring to here. Oh yeah, there it is. Um, Tim Hudson, uh, 2012 blue, tops blue parallel. Uh, I don't know. Is this card actually? Is it the sleeve that's got that mark on it, or is the card? So 2007 uh, Ultimate Collection, Ultimate Rookie Materials, uh, Dual Jersey. Oh yeah, it's the penny sleeve. It's got the, the mark on it. Uh, Drew Stanton, Dual Jersey. Um, I'm not gonna collect any of his stuff. I mean, if there's something of him and the Colts at some point that I uh, I run across. You know, maybe, but uh, I'm not going to pay anything for it. I don't think he's ever going to get any playing time, and if he does, God, God help me. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, this is, he didn't exactly come in to the team on the best terms with the whole Jets blow up, so uh, not really thrilled about his attitude, to be honest. And then uh, the card that he found at the LCS, they actually had posted this online, and I talked to him about it. Uh, after he emailed, it sends me a text message saying, did you name drop me in a best offer to my LCS? I said, yes, I did. Uh, so this is one of the, uh, hopefully a PMG later on down the road, 2011 totally certified, uh, totally uh, emerald, I imagine, is what they're calling this. Uh, number three of five, Reggie Wayne. And the back. A little three of five up there, so yeah, got that one for you know, like I said, in in trade at a decent uh, decent rate. Micah, thank you for facilitating that uh, for us. Uh, appreciate it. Saved uh, shipping and at all and bringing business to the LCS. That's what it's about. Uh, going to be doing uh, a big sidewalk sale at Mike's Cards and Collectibles tomorrow. Turn it into a uh, proverbial card kegger, if you will, uh, and we'll. Uh, I'll probably be back with a recap on that. I don't know, a couple days maybe. All right, and uh, got a package as promised during the blog from that guy. Sevens uh, went to his blog making memories contest blog finale, which was about two minutes of him telling everybody who won and then about an hour of them all goofing around and uh, you know breaking boxes Tom enjoy these damn it Michael so <laughs> you gotta love the note uh, alright I'll do that order there we go 
2010 certified fabric of the game, uh, 33 out of 250 Raymond Berry jersey. 2008 uh, Legends, uh, of course, uh, one of Michael's favorite products. Uh, number 39 out of 100 Lenny Moore jersey. Followed up with a 2011 Panini, sorry, 2010 Panini Threads, 54 out of 175 uh, Century Legends, Lenny Moore jersey. And then uh, also from Totally Certified, keeping with that theme, uh, this is the Immortals, uh, totally gold uh, autograph of uh, Lydell Mitchell. So he pulled that, and I'm like, I am on that like white on rice. So he just sent it my way, because that's the kind of guy he is. So, uh, Michael, uh, I have a package ready to send your way, uh, manana. So keep an eye out next week uh, for something... Uh, on its way back to you. Uh, I want to thank um, Michael, ARFALC77, uh, Micah Distemic. Uh, also, check out the last couple of uh, packs uh, from Puff Bear 359. He's doing some mystery packs, and you know how Puff does. Puff does a big. And if you are in the area, and this could be you too, Puff, uh, if you're in the Connecticut area, passing through on the holiday weekend perhaps. Uh, tomorrow from, I believe the hours are 11 to 5, uh, at Mike's, uh, Cards and Collectibles, uh, in East Haven, Connecticut. If you need any information at all, uh, including, uh, when I might be there, i probably, probably be there most of the day. Um, but starting around 11, uh, there it is, Mike's Cards and Collectibles, 230 Main Street, East Haven, Connecticut. F there's a phone number, 203-466-6227. Or email Mike's Cards and Collectibles at gmail.com. He will uh, respond to that quickly as well. He has an iPhone. So, uh, once again, uh, thanks to everyone. Have a nice holiday weekend and uh, enjoy all these break videos coming up. And uh, one last thing if you have not subscribed to JPKJPK19, please do so now. Link is in the description box. National Treasures are in hand. He's already starting to bust. Uh, I'm, I imagine he's just going to do review vids because uh, he doesn't like to film his breaks, so he can kind of sit back and enjoy. Uh, I know of one card already from the break because he sent me a picture me message. Oh, boy. He, is, uh, he pulled a monster. That's all I'm going to say. All right, YouTube. Peace.